there's a new nonprofit in town, the Preservation Society of Nashville. And as you can guess, the goal is to preserve places that make up Nashville's rich history. It's no easy task for a city undergoing so much change, but as News Channel 5's Olivia Michael explains, preserving the past means planning carefully for the future. If walls could talk, imagine what they would say in Printer's Alley. Nashville is a city of storytellers, but we haven't necessarily done a great job of telling the story of our places. That's where Kelly Bannon and the Preservation Society of Nashville come in. I think it's just easy to go, oh, that place is safe. It's so important to our city. I'm sure nothing will ever happen to it. And that's just not the case. The nonprofit has a lofty goal of raising a million dollars, but so far they're well on their way. And our hope is to make the first two essential hires this year. The money will also go towards grant funding. The, the, the vulnerable historic places, Second Avenue and Broadway, I mean, this is what actually attracts so many of our visitors. Visitors like Rhonda and Stephen Bell. A lot of cities are building up or taking out the older areas. Right, they're repopulating the skyscrapers. I think they lose a little bit of their identity when they do that. A lot of people asked, is there enough to save? Which I thought was a really painful um, and really sad question that we've gotten to a, a point where it's even, is there anything we can do? But as Bannon looks around Printer's Alley, she knows what's at stake. This is not about finger pointing. I think it's about trying to be creative and constructive as we problem solve together. So that walls like these will have stories to tell for generations to come. Olivia Michael, News Channel 5. So far, the Preservation Society has raised more than $300,000.